So we have some coursework about Cheesy the Sandwich, a cheese knife, and an axe. Oh, and some, uh, some Lynx body spray. I don't really want to know what's been going on here, to be honest. Well, I've just managed to go and find somewhere that I've been meaning to go and take a look at for quite a while. Um, as always though, guys, if you know where it is, keep it under your hat. Let's take a look. It is just over there for the bushes and I can see it, but there's a pond in front of it. I'm kind of stinging nettles this way. I was hoping I can actually get to it. Glad I wore jeans and not uh, anything thinner, otherwise I'd be getting stung to buggery right now. There is running water down here, which I'm hoping I can cross. Yeah, it's pretty thick through that way. No, maybe that's plan B. Let's go upstream and around the top, maybe that'll work a bit better. Whoa. I love waterproof boots. Whoa. Swing and a hit. Oh, Jesus. Fact is, I feel like I'm wandering through an absolute wilderness. Despite the fact I can hear a main road and somebody mowing their lawn just over there. So I'm really not. This is it. This is where I've been looking for. I have seen pictures of it for years. I only actually worked out where it was about six months ago. Oh, nice old fridge. My shelf doing well. I mean, the mishmash of brickwork in here is amazing. It's quite clear that this has been modified and changed many times. Um, do I go around the front or do I just go through this window? Definitely guys. Through the window. Yeah, through the window. Oh, that's a squidgy mess. Oh. This is a proper little Frankenstein of a property. You've got like modern breeze block bits, but you've got very old brickwork bits over here. You've got a uh, UPVC double glazed window up there, but a uh, wood frame single glazed window down there. So from what research I've managed to do about this place, as far as I know, it was originally owned by a music teacher. Um, and I believe some people used to have band practices here back in the day, but otherwise it's just an old cottage but uh, quite a unique example and uh, quite interesting to see it slowly being reclaimed by nature. Here's the stairs, what was the stairs? Not very stairy anymore but there isn't really an upstairs anymore either. Murky as hell in there, it's definitely worth getting some shots of that. Well I'm in the uh, extension now guys and uh, can you hear that guy mowing his lawn back there? A proper little fancy ride on mower, a little bit jealous. Not that I've got a garden big enough for it. But yeah, this, this is obviously a much more modern room. You can see where it's attached to the older building. And uh, breeze block construction is a lot more new. It's a can of Lynx body spray. Lynx Africa of all things as well, by the looks of it. Uh, some lucky ladies here, I think. Any starch in Cheesy the Sandwich when it's first broken down? <laughs> Cheesy the Sandwich, what a name. So it looks like someone's been trying to get rid of their, uh, their GCSE coursework. I'm guessing they failed biology. I just really didn't like it. Bet you they're a doctor now. Yeah. There's an axe in the corner as well. And a cheese knife. So we have some coursework about Cheesy the Sandwich, a cheese knife and an axe. Oh, and some, uh, some Lynx body spray. I don't really want to know what's been going on here, to be honest. Oh, this looks like there's a garage. Oh, here we go. The graffiti. Bruce Banner seems to have come through that wall at some point. Could have used the door, couldn't he? So all in all, guys, this is quite a weird one. Um, the actual, what was the main body of the house, appears to be mostly untouched. It, it, it looks like nature has done most of the damage there but uh, on both of the new build outhouses either side of it, it definitely looks like uh, the giddies have been here causing a bit of mayhem. It's a shame when people intentionally destroy stuff for no great reason. I like it when things are falling apart. 
of their own accord because nature's taken them back rather than some idiot has decided to go, <laughs> I'm gonna smash it up. Well guys, if you liked this video, you should probably watch this one next, but otherwise, thank you very much for watching.